What's going on guys? It's Tizzy here again, and uh, uh, as you can see, I'm playing Black Ops again. Um, I think I'm going to start posting more Black Ops gameplay than uh, Modern Warfare 3, because I'm going to be honest with you, I like Black Ops a lot more than I like Modern Warfare 3. Uh, if, you don't, if you don't like watching Black Ops gameplay or, you know, whatever it is, uh, feel free to unsubscribe, because uh, I'm posting videos because I enjoy it, and... Uh, you know, if you like Black Ops gameplay, that's that's great. You can sit here and watch them all day, but um, but I think I'm gonna post more of these now, because I really like playing Black, Black Ops, and uh, to me, it's like the last good Call of Duty. Uh, Modern Warfare 3 wasn't that good to me. It was okay, uh, but anyway, that's not what I'm talking about today. Um, today I want to talk about something that uh, well, I don't know. It's just it just gets on my nerves. There's a lot of people, and a good example of this are the people in my game right now, uh, that smoke weed. <laughs> they smoke weed. And, uh, you know, these people in my game, they have gamer tags like uh, the Blazing Stoner, and their emblems are a weed, or a marijuana leaf, and they got 420 as their clan tag. Now, <laughs> um, I don't have a problem with you, really if you smoke weed. Now, I don't recommend smoking weed. Like, I I don't think you should do it. But if you do, um, I'm not gonna judge you too hard. Um, I'll still be your friend or whatever if you smoke weed. Like, it's not a huge problem. What is a problem with me, though, there's a lot of people out there that do smoke weed, and they seem to be really proud of their uh, druggish ways. Because, like these people in my game right now, they put 420 as their clan tag, and they put a marijuana leaf as their emblem. Or on Modern Warfare 3, they'll put that as their emblem on there. And uh, I think that's when it gets pretty ridiculous. I think that's when it becomes too much for me to handle. And I think that's why most people that are against pot and drugs like that um, are the way they are about that kind of thing. And frankly, I don't blame them. Now, I'm not going to go out and start, like, an anti-pot rally. I'm not going to start a petition to keep marijuana illegal or anything like that, because I don't really care either way. If it becomes legalized, at least that'll shut the stoners up. That's how I feel about it, because, quite frankly, I'm getting pretty sick and tired of hearing uh, potheads talk about how great weed is, and just always talking about it. There's people in my third period class at school, um... Actually, not anymore because the semester's over, but there was. Uh, third In my third period class, I was surrounded by people who just did drugs all the time. And every day, all I heard about was, yo, man, you got that kush, dog? You got that, uh, you know, tried that heroin yet? Uh, <laughs> but, um, you know, like, that's all I hear. It seems like most people that do drugs, and I'm not saying all people, because I'm sure there's some of you out there that do them, and you're not like this. Um, but it seems like most people that do drugs uh, do them to either uh, fit in or look cool. I don't care how corny that sounds. I think it's true. Or they do it because they have nothing else to talk about, honestly. that's I swear, the only reason they do it. Uh, they really don't have anything to talk about other than what they smoked last night and that's so annoying to me because I could care less what you do in your spare time unless it's something remarkable uh, don't tell me about it because I don't care that you went out and you bought five dollars worth of some kind of drug and you tripped out so hard last night because that doesn't affect me at all if anything that gives me a more negative opinion on you and uh, you really should keep that kind of stuff to yourself or your friends that you did it with. You know, like I said, I don't really care if you do it. But the one thing that gets on my nerves about all this drug stuff is when you uh, brag about it. That's really the only problem I have with it. Now, obviously, there's some drugs like cocaine or heroin, whatever. Like, no, don't do that. <laughs> I, I really don't think you should do that. Um, because those are obviously very bad for you and addictive. And there's a lot of people that do uh, smoke weed that um, that say it's not addictive 
it's not bad for you. It's actually good for you. Um, and they support legalizing weed because it'll stimulate the economy. Well, I hate to break it to you, but most of those things are not true. It is not good for you. Uh, the number one excuse I hear for it's good for you is that it's natural. Now, uh, I don't know about you, but I'm pretty sure that most people that smoke weed don't smoke natural weed. Um, I'm pretty sure that they smoke something that's got something in it, something that's been made somewhere with an extra chemical in it to make it taste better, to make it more addictive, whatever it is. Uh, weed without anything in it, like, I'm not all up on my marijuana lingo, but I'm pretty sure weed without anything in it is called Reggie, and it's not good at all. Like, it's not, it, it doesn't get you high from what I've been told, and, you know, most people don't do that because apparently it just doesn't work for them, so they get something that's synthetic. Um, and that's when it becomes unhealthy, because you're taking things into your body that aren't natural, and that's unhealthy. Now true, if you're smoking weed that is completely natural, um, that's definitely not as bad for you as alcohol or cigarettes or anything like that. But it still is bad for you, because uh, there's no denying it, you are inhaling smoke and uh, you are getting smoke into your lungs and if you think that that's healthy for you then you're wrong <laughs> um, also them saying it stimulates the economy uh, granted it could stimulate the economy if it was done right taxed but uh, it wouldn't be. there would always be something gone wrong with it and if you do your research it really wouldn't do so much to the economy that it'd be worth uh, legalizing it um, and I can't remember the third thing I said, but this video is almost over. So uh, just let me know what you think in the comments below because I, you know, I don't like, I'm not an anti-pot guy, but if you do it, that's fine. Just keep it to yourself. But anyways, this game's over. So uh, that's my feelings on the matter. If you have a different opinion or you share my opinion, please let me know in the comments below. And I will see you guys later.